there's been like it feels like there's been so many changes since like Man. really yeah. in the last couple of weeks. Couple yeah, weeks. Something I've learned Roof, from Coach Lev, yeah. like yeah. Some I've learned from like college ball that like that's different from high school ball. Like high school ball, you with the same yeah, dudes you really got all a lot four of years. Yeah. And like if something changes, it's like the new news, like students coming in, mm-hmm. maybe one transfer. But like in college, you're getting a whole new got team it, yeah. every season. And it's different, you know, with the NIL and stuff like that. Is that's true. Is this is basically every every um, transfer portal window that we have is basically free agency. Literally, <laughs> that's, that's what it's become. Basically, and so it's, it's we're a miniature league right now. Mm-hmm. We're um, we're the more glorified of USFL and stuff like that, when which you, is what's crazy. When do you think they're gonna like start like putting they regulations put in place? I think I think the NCAA stuff. is no longer gonna run it. That's what, mm. and I think it's gonna be like um, they're going to make uh, that their some, own. The other head, co- the previous head coaches mm. are gonna be a, a, a group like a table. Oh, like that's a, like they're like gonna head, make their like own like, like yeah, yeah, you know, they're gonna be like the table that you go and dress if you break a rule or like you mm. gotta go see the table. Or um, something along those lines. See the table. That's like it sounds like like, you know, like John Wick. You know, so <laughs> what real. is it? Uh, <laughs> something like in John Wick, we had to go see the hotel people or whatever. Yeah. But um, I, I definitely think I don't think there's gonna be a cap on it because it's too late. Like you can't retrace. You know. Yeah. You, you, that's then you're, you're, you're you've gone from a point to where you, you we've for hundreds of years you've talked about people not being eligible to make money. And then now you're going to put a cap on how much money they can make. I feel like they should have, if they were going to do it, they had to do it as NIO got like legalized. Yeah, I feel yeah. like. Because now it's, it's, you can't, really, yeah, like you said, you can't backtrack now. Yeah, you can't, you can't late. retrace. What do you think about with all like the transfer portal stuff? Like you think they're going to, I feel like they've already kind of like, uh, what's the word I'm trying to look for? They've already kind of backtracked with transfer portal. Like they shut down some of the windows, like made them smaller. But yeah. I, that's really all you can like. I don't. Do. I, I don't even think that's like. A- What's up, Red Dirt fam? We have some very exciting news for y'all. February seventeenth, Red Dirt Media will be hosting a special event at Noun Hotel. It will be me and Nick, accompanied by ten or so of our teammates. There's gonna be dinner, drinks, player interactions, interviews. It's gonna start at six p.m. and it, all the tickets are limited, so make sure you go check it out. Boomer. Enough, really. Like the same amount of stuff is gonna happen. Then we have more people in the transfer portal yeah. this time around than any other than any of the other times. Yeah, yeah, we did. Excuse me. Yeah. Um, the thing is, is they is is here soon is you're gonna be able to do unlimited transfers, but that's your the, years that's so crazy, are right? still gonna be terminated until I think like your grad transfer year. So you oh your years will still be terminated. Yeah, like, yeah. So like so you lose you'll only get you one. They're, they're gonna turn it into where you'll only get one free transfer, mm-hmm. like how you normally do, and then once you transfer after that, you're burning those years of eligibility. Mm. They haven't done that yet. So if you transfer twice now, you get that year yeah. back that you transferred on again, pretty mm. much. You see that the Washington or where do you go? Mississippi State QB? Yeah, you Will Rogers. from Mississippi State. Then so, went to Washington. Then, then he, he hit the portal again. Yeah. Like what? He transferred like in like, this one portal. Yeah, in this one yeah. portal opener. Because, it's because, the, because the now Washington I'm, coach left, so he gets like yeah, a, he gets another 30 days. I he think. Gets a, yeah, extension. That's wild. Yeah. I think it's crazy, bro. I don't know if I really know. I, I think the transfer portal has its benefits, but at the same time, I feel like it was just a different era of college when, like, you were locked into, like, yeah. the place you committed to. Like, yeah, teams yeah. really – like, you couldn't really go from being, like, mediocre to good, like, fast. Like, you had to really, like, build it up and, like, start yeah. from the ground up. Yeah. But it definitely has its benefits, though. I don't know. I mean, and, it, there's always the benefits for the people that, like – Yeah, like, coming out of a, a harder situation and yeah. stuff like that. And, like, we have, like – Great players that like are prime example like Baker Mayfield that was transferred. Yeah, yeah. and he was he was competing in the spot with uh, a lot of other good quarterbacks. Yeah, you know, that's a different situation. And now he's playing for a playoff. So. Right, and some people are transferring for the reasons of reasons. money. Yeah. You know, mm-hmm. yeah. like that's why Alabama had that dynasty for so long because they it was just built on built and everybody it was just class after class they had built upon mm-hmm. those and they had momentum going. Now it's kind of hard to do. You don't really see a lot of back to back. Georgia's an example, but you don't see a lot of people transfer from there. In Clemson as well, when they won all those championships, you didn't see people transferring in or transferring out because mm-hmm. they were built up on that. That is one thing I noticed though. Like we were saying in a couple of earlier podcasts, like 
college football has been so unpredictable. And, like, we didn't really know, like, what, like, but now like you, the reasoning for it. it but, like, it transfer sense. portal. Like, before yeah, the transfer yeah. portal, like, you knew who was going to be in the, like, yeah. playoffs. Like, you like the idea. way too early predictions weren't that far off. Yeah. But now they're, like. Now it's, like. Yeah. It's anybody's game. Yeah, no doubt. <laughs> anybody can compete because anybody can pay. Yeah. Anybody. Yeah. Amen. You think you think that's why. People said that's why Saban left. Yeah. I, 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 I think they said true. he couldn't keep up. That's what, I, that's what he said. You, he, you don't think said, Bama could have kept up? Though? I don't know. No, no, they. I don't think he wanted to compete on that yeah. level of doing that. It just. I think it takes the. Um, like it's it, it's so transactional at that point. Like you're gonna Literally. come here based on how much money I give you, not how I develop you. You'll rather go to like let's say Miami of Ohio, for example. They're willing to give you a million dollars. You're not gonna get developed as good as you would there as you would here. That's yeah. so crazy, bro. That's like that's a part of the trip, the portal and like nil. I don't really like, bro. Like, yeah. You can literally it's, just it's not it's not about long term anymore. It's about short term. Yeah, I feel like you can just like I feel like people just start committing and doing stuff for the wrong reasons. Like mm -hmm. like if I was here not getting paid, like I would still like, I would still enjoy where I was at. Like I would still like, yeah. I committed here. I didn't commit here for money. Like, yeah. like if I know it was never even talked about, like Nobody would care. Well, it wasn't when we were coming. That's the funny thing. When we were coming out of high school, it was just a lot of everyone was like it. shaming it and like yeah, yeah. like <laughs> like they talked about it on the recruiting visits, but it was never like a, like oh I'm How gonna did, get paid a lot yeah. of money. So like right, we're gonna oh, pay I, you. I, I, can, I can get a free meal if I post something on my story. Right, like, cool, right, that's done. Right, and right. then we get here, it's just blowing up. Yeah, no doubt. What even was like the argument though? Like, what were people trying to argue against it? For? Like, why wasn't it? Like, I don't why, remember. Like, why we shouldn't get paid? Yeah, like, cause we didn't. It, it just came to fruition like a couple, two, maybe three. I don't know what their I don't know what their initial argument was, but like now they definitely have arguments. Cause I remember like, like free agency and stuff. Uh, destroying like the YouTuber. Yeah, they like tarnished. They, they oh, yeah, they they yeah, they're they're eligible. his eligibility for YouTube. They they made him choose, and he was like, "No, nah, I'm gonna choose YouTube." Well, yeah, he was making like, six figures off YouTube. Mm -hmm. Why were people hating? Like, I don't understand. Like. I don't know. Like, oh, you can't play football and get paid. And I feel like, like. it wasn't I feel like it wasn't even like the like younger fans. It was like the older yeah. like people in charge that were like, I guess I had can't. a problem with it. I can't well, really now blame they're, them. they're the biggest supporters of it. Not yeah. for them, you know. They're making a lot of the money. older the older generation of the biggest the biggest supporters of it because they're the biggest donors in most cases. Yeah. You know? I mean I, I can't really blame them for like before NAO was a thing, like not supporting it, because I mean they've they didn't really have anything to go off of. Like it's just kind of how it's been their whole life. So yeah. 